Okay, this is KF5 HCR. This is a fixed value, fixed plate, adjustable value, variable dielectric, variable capacitor. Two fixed plates. That's high capacity, low capacity. In English values, in inches, generates picofarads. This is the dielectric. Those discs are 2 to 11 16 inch felt paper nail pads from the hardware store. The gap is 0 0.196 inches. The dielectric is 98 thousandths thick. This yields about 150 to 180 picofarads, increasing capacitance with the plastic inserted. This is a simple clap VFO. It's a variant of a Colpitz oscillator. It's very stable. It can be used as a transmitter alone or to adjust the frequency coverage of a direct conversion receiver like a Pixie by simply removing the crystal from the Pixie and putting the output here into where the crystal used to be on the Pixie's base. Using a 4.4 microhenry handwound coil, we get a signal at about 6.8. You're at zero B there. And that's predicted. So if you insert it, the signal, take this crystal out, insert it right here through a capacitor or the capacitor send this circuit directly into the base, then you can have variable frequency operation on your direct conversion receivers. By removing the coil, and inserting, this is a 3.579 megahertz color burst crystal. Converts it back to a crystal control Colpitz oscillator that will pull slightly That's not it.